One of these questions that many people have is why do we even program? Right? What is the need for it? You see in the digital world, most of what you see on your cell phone, on your computers or um, be it on the internet, you open a web page, all of these are in fact some programs. Someone should have written a piece of code for all these things. That said, if I can tell you in one sentence what is programming, it's about getting things done really, really fast. All right? You can always ask me this question, can we replace, can we do without computers? Can we do without any of this programming? Of course, yes, we can. But the point is, it makes our life really, really, really simple. It makes it really fast and nice for you to execute a piece of task. For example, if you were to go to your um, uh, train reservation system, right, and see when exactly you had traveled from this location to this location, it's very easy for you to put a search query inside your uh, reservation uh, website and then see where all you have traveled. Otherwise, you should maintain a big log of uh, where you go, what you have done, and from there you may have to search through it manually. Let's say for instance, I am traveling from Delhi to Bangalore, okay? So what do I do? I go to the railway station, ensure that my name is there on the chart, board the train, and my friend is checking whether the train has started on time or not, so that he knows that it reaches on time. And he can even trace where exactly my train is. And as I'm having my journey, I open YouTube and then watch a good uh, video, maybe even a movie, right? And then I send out a couple of emails to my friends. And then I reach Bangalore. After reaching Bangalore, I open my cell phone and then try booking a taxi through a popular application. Right? And then I reach back home and pay the taxi person the money that my phone tells me to pay. You see, the entire thing from um, boarding my train until reaching my home, I have been using applications and all of them, not even excluding one, all of them are in fact bits and pieces of programming. A whole lot of programming. The whole of digital world is being made by these programs only. And the atomic blocks of it, how exactly do we go about getting our programming done is what we will be initiating you all with. So you mean to say every step of our life, every day, every minute, somewhere we are using programs? Almost everywhere today, I can say. Because uh, you see, you, you go to a shop and you do an online transfer, you pay it through your uh, favorite application to the shopkeeper. In fact, uh, every shopkeeper these days, they have one application or the other through which you can transfer money to them, right? So I, we can hardly imagine a life today without digital um, way of handling things. Let's say, uh, be it paying money or be it getting a, um, Amazon, uh, getting your favorite product delivered through Amazon. It all involves the digital world. And by digital world, that's a layman's term. What happens in this world is a whole lot of code, a whole lot of programs wherein you precisely tell your computer what to do, what not to do, how to handle exceptions and things like that.